Man, that zombie problem's getting pretty bad out there. It's weird how the muscle spasms make him do the robot like that, too. Yeah, I didn't think the robot would be such a big part of the apocalypse. Pretty freaking crazy. Well, I guess we better bunker down here for a while. I just can't believe Bill Gates did something like this. I know. Wait, what? I mean, I guess we should have seen it coming, but still. I don't I don't think Bill Gates has anything to do with this. Oh yeah, he's definitely behind this. You notice how we keep having to look through windows? Why, why would he? So he can figure out a way to track us. What are you talking about? He's gonna make an anti-zombie vaccine and then we're all gonna have little tracking devices on us at all times. Where did you hear that? A bunch of articles I found on Facebook. On the GPS-enabled smart device that you voluntarily purchased and unlock with your face and carry everywhere? You know it, there's a guy that explains the whole thing on patriotbattletruth.info. Oh, that is a very sketchy URL for sure. Dude's a patriot and battles to tell the truth. How is that sketchy? Okay, I mean, either way, we should definitely stay inside. What do you mean? Because of the zombies. Uh, okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. Well, I'm gonna head out. Wait, 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 what are you doing? Well, listen, I don't like being inside this much, so I'm gonna go to some places. But you, there are zombies. Yeah, I'm just, I don't, eh. I feel like we should definitely avoid going out as much as possible. Look, it sucks that some people are zombies, but it's a very small number. You can't let that control, like, if I get bit, I'll probably be fine. Okay, but you could spread being a zombie to other people. Okay, but we can't stay inside forever. We gotta work to feed our families and stuff. Yeah, no, I mean, yeah, people do need to work for a living. So I'm gonna head out. Okay, look, if we're gonna open up the economy let's do it safely okay wear these headphones headphones well like 99 percent of medical professionals are saying that zombies can smell your brains through your ears so if you wear headphones that could stop the spread of you know being a zombie oh right okay yeah no i'm not gonna do that what why well headphones get uncomfortable after a while i mean a little i don't like how they feel on my ears okay but if everybody wears them we could potentially save a lot of lives right like if you become a zombie you can make somebody else a zombie okay right but you gotta look at it from my perspective too which is that you're ears would be uncomfortable for a little bit? My ears would be uncomfortable for a little bit. Right. My ears. Okay, well look at it this way. Wearing headphones is an act of compassion, right? Because it's not, it's not all about you. Okay, look, I see what you're saying. I do, but let me just ask you one thing, okay? What? Say I were to wear headphones. Yeah. And this is just, this is just a hypothetical, right? Right. Would I be, would I, would, would, would my ears be comfortable? Not completely, no. Well, then I'm not doing it. Okay, do you maybe see how that comes across as selfish? Listen, if you wear headphones, that blocks the air in inside your head and it's going to blow up like a balloon. That's just basic science. Right, do you have any scientific data to back up that claim or? Well, I don't believe in science. Also, headphones probably don't do anything. Okay. So if you don't mind, I'm gonna go to Walmart and I'm going to lose my mind at some minimum wage employees. Please don't do that. Look, I don't know what to tell you, man. Health officials are trying to infringe on my liberty, so I'm going to go yell at a teen mom who's just trying to get by. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, but they're trying to save lives, right? It's like how they tell people to wear seatbelts. Okay, okay. Now, why would I wear a seatbelt? Oh, my God.